Hi, Helen Tarrant here for Commercial Property Roadshow. Welcome to another episode. I'm here at Wilson Audio in Utah. So, um, and I'm here about to do an inspection of their office. Um, they're actually like, they're equivalent to the Ferrari of the hi-fi world. So what they are is the top end uh, audio. And um, so their speakers range from $10,000 US for a tiny speaker on your desk for your uh, computer to all the way loudspeakers of $850,000 US. So we're just going to have a walkthrough of their offices and their factory. And so you get to see what it's like, um, how commercial property is you know, just the same in any other country. And so let's go and have a look. Hi, this is Helen Tarrant. Here we're coming through the front door area and um, we're here seeing some office space. Uh, we can see the awards and the history of this place. The back um, in there is the, they have a little boardroom in there and we are going through this um, into their office. So we've got their factory there at the back and here we've got the um, reception area. We've got some of the sales offices here. There. And we've got um, another sales office. You can see that this is um, Wilson Audio. Uh, and we've got the, um, the different parts of it. So let's go down and let's have a look down here at the different offices. Here you can see the history of the company. And hello here. And um, we've got some different areas, a little testing room, and we've got different testing rooms so that they can test out how the speakers sound. So it's all very, very exciting and things done to our absolute best. And um, we're just gonna pop our head in to the um, the warehouse so you get to see that. And I've got some images of some of the more proprietary stuff upstairs, which I'll show you as well. Um, let's just have a look through here. We're inside the manufacturing area in here. And I'm just gonna close that door softly. Hopefully I can get out. Um, so I've just gone up the stairs and you can see that here we've got a manufacturing area. Um, so we're about to walk through and this is how speakers are produced. They produce everything in-house here in Utah, which is very, very exciting. Um, so every little bit of the actual hi-fi system is actually tested here. And I myself am not an expert in this, but I just love looking at the different office spaces and noticing all the differences of, uh, of how the office is built, how it's multifunctional, how it works for all different parts. This is things in a box before it's shipped out. Um, you can see that there is also a second floor that can be built if they can expand. Uh, we're just about to go in and into the factory to have a quick look, a quick peek into this uh, because it is very exciting here. Is some of the sample of their products, um, something like this will be well in excess, um, well closer to your $850,000 when it's totally completed. So now I'm going to show you the factory, but it's going to be a bit loud, so I won't talk, but you get to see it. Um, some of their raw products here, this is before it goes into fully being pr produced. Here's just a quick little one of something that almost finished product. Um, we've got some of their employees on the wall. I'll show you the inside of this doing some of their painting and here at the factory you can see they're making they're starting to make all the different pieces we'll pop our head in so you get to see what it's like it's really really quite exciting and you know you get to see the way that things are delivered and there's lovely different ways of polishing up the actual speakers and the different colours of what they look like. This is their spray room here.
it's just amazing to see the workmanship of all of these products and there is there is a four week wait from when you order the product in the states um to when it's actually it's 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 custom made and they have a wait list and that's how great their products are so you can see that um here it's uh some of the products waiting for color to come through so they can paint them We're about to go through the factory floor to the next one where this is where it's like a car spraying company where they actually almost like that but they're spraying the speakers oh sorry hello, hello. Oh, i almost lost my camera there sorry but um, there are people that are actually working here, so I don't want to disturb their work, but I wanted to show you because it's absolutely fascinating. Here's part of their paint booth where they match up the colors, and I want to show you the different colors that they have. So this is a chart of the different colors. Love that color purple um, because that's our unicorn color for our group deals. Love those colors red, but you can see they can match these colors to anything pretty much that you're, that you're looking for. And so it's pretty warm here. Um, and here you can see some of their almost finished products at the back. So the different colors. Now this hasn't gone through a next polishing stage, but it's just after that, the next stage in here as well. So it's really quite exciting that we get the inside look into this because rarely is that done. Now here we're at the next stage. Here is where they take that one that's already been painted um, and they polish and do a hand polish. So. So that's, again, very, very exciting. I'm inside their paint room, um, checking out all their doors, looking at what they have. So this leads back to where we were before. So we must go that way. But you can see how versatile they, you can deck out something to your specifications so that you can really come out of it and have something that it's, it's literally a factory inside a building that you think it's an office space. So here we have almost all the finished products now. Um, we're going, this is where quality control is. So you can see the different colors and here that most people spend about a week here to quality control checking to make sure the paintwork is absolutely out to scratch. So you can see how lovely something like this is, you know, the beautiful finish on that. And it's absolutely tested before it goes out um, onto the market because all of these things is really, really important um, as we go through this. Um, so that you know that the product you are getting is absolutely tip top as well. So um, here we're in a bit of a staff room area um, where we've got some uh, some other pieces being manufactured as well, just more uh, assembly area. And I love this area, which I have to show you. This is like their museum archive. So for any of you who are hi-fi junkies out there, this is the selection they had um, have produced in the past and they continue to produce different ones and continue to test different ones but I wanted to show you so you get to see that um, what they actually do have as well so something that you could literally it's millions and millions of dollars of product here as well right now so all very very exciting um, as you get to see that uh, how there's different varieties, how that's built for uh, purposely built, obviously for uh, the different customers, the clients and, and what they want. They can match it to if you wanted to have a um, something that matches your fit out at home or your office, they can definitely do that as well. And with that, we're actually exiting the main part of it. Now, up, they've got an upstairs level, which they do some of the electronics and they test out some of um, the, the electronic components of it, but that's mostly a lot of it that's R&D as well. So we're just popping down the stairs now and going through the exit so you get to see what the outside looks like. Now, to really, this is fascinating. We've got a little room that's already dark. That's um, there actually, that's where they do most of their um, photography and videos of their new products. So we've got all these things on the wall, all the things that they contribute to um, in terms of in the past where their speakers and products have been used as well. So now, um, we're coming to the end of the tour 
And is that the way out? This is. Okay, great. <laughs> that's, that's out to the parking area on oh. the north side of the building. Okay. If you want back. That way? This, this way I'll yes, show that you. way. <laughs> Thank you. Mm -hmm. All right. Be a labyrinth. Yes. Right. Ah, right. Ah, thank you. Thank you very much. Thank you. Now I found my way out. The other way was to the back of the building. So I'm just going to head out to the front so you get to see what the front of the building looks like. Uh, and then um, we would. Um, then I'm going to go and listen to some speakers, listen to how they perform because that's really, really important. So I'm here outside of the Wilson Audio uh, and I wanted just to show you that the building itself is not nothing really magically fancy about it, but it is very, very functional and it is quite lovely inside because it is actually really purposely built. But just to show you the scenery, how beautiful that is in Utah. We're a Provo in Utah and um, it's such big open spaces uh, it's about seven degrees now at the moment seven degrees celsius and you can see how lovely um, it is it's crisp it's about three o'clock in the afternoon and um, we've got a really great insight about how um, commercial property works in a state in the u.s so for me it's all about bringing you new and interesting and new experiences and inspections so i hope you enjoyed this one because absolutely it is something that is new and something you don't usually see so now now I'm going to go and listen to some speakers and um, join me for the next episode. Don't forget, click on the bell and subscribe. And if you want to have a conversation how I can help you in a commercial property journey, go to helentarrant.com. I look forward to seeing you in the next episode. Bye for now.